Hi guys, welcome. In today's video, we are going to learn how to create notification in our Android application. Here is a quick example. We have an application here with a one button. When I click the button, the notification appears. Now let's build the application. As always, you can find the sample code in the video description. First create the layout. I'm gonna use the relative layout. You can use any layout you want. So delete the constant layout and replace it with the relative layout. Now we are gonna create a simple button here with an height and width wrap content. Place the button in the center position and give the button text notification. And last, let's give the button an ID. I'm gonna call it click. It doesn't matter actually. Now that our layout is finished, let's go to the main activity.java. First, we're gonna initialize our button. So, button, call it button. Button is equal to find view by id r dot id dot button now set on click listener on this button and in the on click method we are gonna write our code that will appear the notification so use notification compact class call it notification compact dot builder call it m builder is equal to now we have to cast this notification dot builder and new notification compact dot builder and here we have to pass the application context first let's import the icon that we want to show it in our notification so copy that image and paste it under the drawable folder. Now you can call dot set small icon and target that icon that you have pasted in the drawable. The notification title call set content title. I am going to hard code it the title in string form and for the other part like description call dot set content text and paste it the description in a hard coded string form. And now finish the statement with the semicolon. For this notification to work we need notification manager class. So notification manager equal to cast it to notification manager get system service and in the parameter we have to paste notification service Now we have to call this notification manager object and then dot notify. Pass the ID of the notification, any number should be work. And the second parameter it will take the m builder object and then dot build will finish the notification. Now we can finally test our app and see how it's work. That's it guys for today and if you are new here consider subscribing to my channel for more upcoming series. Thank you guys for watching and I will be seeing you in the next video.